guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing some really exciting Easter baking. I'm so excited. Um, I'm gonna try and film as much as possible in the best way for you guys. Sav is joining me, so she's gonna pick up the camera and film all the close-ups and stuff so you can actually see what we're doing. Because um, I know baking videos in the past have been a nightmare for me to film. Um, but yeah, we're gonna start off with uh, rice mini egg rice crispy squares which sound delicious so let's get into it all right we've got to start off by lining a nine by nine square tin with parchment paper I don't have a nine by nine tin I've got a casserole dish so we're gonna measure this as best as we can I also don't have a ruler, so I don't know how I'm going to do that. This is what I'm going to use. Can I mark this and then put it in the oven? Is that, is that a thing? Oh, nine inches isn't that big, is it? This is about nine inches, so... Yeah. We'll do it to here. Yeah. Any you parchment paper? Ah, ah, ah. Is there anything you need to be uh, It will do. Not for this one. Watch yeah. What's next on the agenda? Add the butter and mini marshmallows to a large pan. Okay, we need scales. <laughs> We're doing Jane, Jane's patisserie recipe, by the way. First, we should have it. those first? Yeah. It's all of one and then... I'm going to do some that. Oh, you idiot! Idiot! One, two, three, and then hundred, hundred, twenty. Nah. Yeah, it's really all. Up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all of them apart from the last two. There's only hundred fifty in it. Oh. oh, I can eat this one. Mmm. Marshmallows aren't actually vegetarian. And all of this one. Yeah. Oh, that's a lot of Get 20. It's going to have crumbs in it. It's <laughs> <laughs> just about 50. Yeah. 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 God, that's right, loads of marshmallows. I know. They melt, don't they? Okay, medium heat. Low heat. Oh, oh low medium. to the mixture. I don't know how many. Oh, all of them. Is oh. that right? No. No. Have you got 500 grams of mini eggs? I've got 800. Oh. <laughs> I need to... <laughs> Everything's chaotic. I'm 80 in these packs, so I'm just going to use two packs. Yeah. And the, mm -hmm. These are like some cushions from holding yeah. in the bag. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Yummy, yummy. Oh god, it's really heavy. What do you mean? Because we don't want to Which side are you putting it on? To melt this side. Well, what putting it there going to do? Just get it out of the hot pan. Oh god, it's heavy! Okay, that was really traumatic. We've managed to get it in the tin. Casserole dish. Casserole dish. It's 
smaller than it should be because well, I don't know why it is to be honest, but so I can't see land. It okay. is. <laughs> so I don't know how the chocolate's gonna go on top. We're gonna do the chocolate now. Right. I'm gonna melt this white chocolate in a pan. Some people do it in the microwave, but I just don't trust myself to do that and not burn it. So we're gonna do it over water in a pan. And then we're gonna pour it on top, decorate with some mini eggs. And then it goes in the fridge. Ow. Okay, this went a little bit better than I expected it to. I thought the white chocolate was going to be really high. high. I, was doing. <laughs> I do want it to cover it all though. I thought it was going to be like a really thick layer and it was all going to dribble down the sides and flood. <laughs> like that. Follow me! <laughs> we have mid space. Yay! Bye! See you in two hours. Finish! Woo! Okay, next one. Yeah. Now the rice crispies have gone in the fridge. We're going to start making the Easter blondies. So first we need to preheat the oven to 180 degrees or 165. Have we got a fan oven? Mm. Yeah. 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 Put it on 170. Um, our oven is very temperamental, so we're gonna put it on 170. Oh, we need another nine by nine square tin. I was literally about to say we're gonna need, but we'll just need it for that one. I didn't do my research. Okay, so we don't have another 9x9 nine nine square tin, so we're using a 9 inch cake tin. I think these are 9 inches, I think. Um, if not, then they're not, but it's all good. Here we go with the parchment paper. I'll put that out for you, madam. Thank you. Also, I've the parchment paper. I'm going to melt 200 grams of butter. Apparently that's what we need. That's got more might on it. <laughs> they had odd socks on, so I've swapped them to no odd socks and I've still managed to have odd socks. Odd socks. <laughs> <laughs> right, that's a little bit over, but it's fine. I need a pan. That one. That's what we're doing. Melting in this pan. butter. What? Melting the butter. 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 The butter is melting, so when that is melted, we need to add the melted butter and the sugars whisk till smooth. What sugars do we need? 125 grams of white granulated sugar and 125 grams of light brown sugar. I love brown sugar. Anything that's got brown sugar in is so nice. I'll get a bowl. Pyrex, Pyrex. Ah. I'll pour this in here. Then combine, whisk, whisk, whisk. I don't really like using a whisk. I feel like they're un uncontrollable. Is it meant to be hot? Yeah, well, yeah. Why? Smell the butter. <laughs> yeah, no, but several minutes. Right, we beat these for several minutes, guys, until the mixture is light and smooth. It kind of looks like caramel. You got this, girl. Getting out of here. Jesus. Sure. <laughs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Let's hope wiggles are I can feel off. Oh, she does anything. <laughs> I got an elephant. My bum just shakes when I'm doing this. Right, I'm, I'm over that. Add in the eggs and beat again until smooth. So we're adding three, is it three eggs? Yeah. <laughs> we're adding three eggs. My hands are shaking from whisking, so if I get any shell in it, the shell goes in it. Break yolks, break. Uh, one tea uh, tablespoon. <laughs> one tablespoon of cornflour. There you I need a different song to sing. Right, cornflour in. Back in the what does that even do? Thickens. Oh. And 
275 grams of plain flour. What's coming out of that? What is? <laughs> the flour. Yeah, it does that. <laughs> so they broke. Fuck. I feel like it's summer. 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 I watched that. It In great. summer! <laughs> if you don't know the film. Okay, I'm yeah. so crazy. <laughs> Delish. Mm. I love blondies. I don't know why I love them so much. Flick of the wrist. We have got an electric mixer. I don't know why I'm doing this. It'd tell you to do it that way if it wanted you to. It's not a cake mix. It's all at the bottom. Yeah, but I feel like it gets all the lumps out of the flour if you electric mix it. No. Oh, it's thick. <laughs> She's thick. Okay, we'll be back in a mail. <laughs> <laughs> Chosen chocolates, Antonio. So, now adding 150 grams of white chocolate chips. And did it say 300 grams? Yeah. These are chocolate. Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah.
Oh, maybe not. <laughs> I've been scammed by stalk. Little bit more. Oh, be deaf boy with a bit. <laughs> and to light on fluffy. Cool. This is in for 50 to 60 minutes. It's my arm going on. Can't beat it. The muscle. <laughs> my arm is so much. I'll carry on. You weigh out the flour. I've got a sewer. Okay, so when that is all beaten together, we're adding the flour, the cocoa powder, and the eggs. So I'm just going to measure out the cocoa powder and the flour. So we need 200 grams of self raising flour. Fifty grams of cocoa powder. This is fine dark cocoa powder, but Savannah paid about six pounds for it. <laughs> We're adding in the flour, the cocoa powder, and the eggs, and beat again until it's smooth and lovely. Oh, eggs now. This is what it's looking like. <laughs> These eggs are so golden. I'm just gonna pop all oh, all that in. Five eggs, apparently. Yep. Where are the other ones? from the future. Excuse my webcam. <laughs> don't understand why it looks like this laptop's been made in 1999. Um, but please just watch this next clip and tell me why it looks like we're performing surgery. <laughs> it's just so quiet and <laughs> just watch it. looking like chocolate all spread out let me just push it into this side a little bit more nice there we go right so this one goes in the oven for 50 to 60 minutes yeah okay <laughs> how long have we got left in the blondie five minutes yeah but i don't think it'll be done no, i don't either shall i leave this here for a minute well it's gonna have to stay there for about till that's done yeah Okay. Hi guys, we are back. It has been... It's been about two hours. And I managed to... The, the blondie took way longer than 25 minutes. It took nearly an hour. Probably, it probably should have been in for longer than an hour. But I wanted it to firm up in the fridge. So that's in the fridge cooling. And the... Cream egg cake has been in for 50 minutes now, so I'm just gonna check that. See how it's getting on. It, sh it should be done by now, but I have a feeling that it's not gonna be because our oven is very temperamental. But it has been in for 50 minutes, exactly. Let's see, I think it's still a bit wobbly. Oh my God, it's so wobbly, it's nowhere near done. <laughs> oh my god, okay, right, that's going in for, I put a foil on it because our oven tends to burn really easily on top, very quickly, so that'll just stop the top from burning. I'm going to put that in for another 20 minutes at least. I'm going to try and get the blondie out the case now and onto a cooling rack and then we'll cool it a little bit more in the fridge and then we'll decorate it. So in the oven, the butter was coming out the bottom of this. So God knows what what we're gonna bring this out to look like. We shall see. Hi 
Nelson. 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 Cool. Let's see if I can get it out on here. The case is still really, really warm. And it's been in the fridge for an hour. So, I really don't know. Oh, we really need to here. <laughs> Oh, it's not going to come out. <laughs> Actually, not going to come out. Okay, great. It needs to come out because I need to pull it without the case on. It's so heavy. <sighs> Yay! I'm going to put this back in the fridge just to cool a little bit longer whilst it's out of the tin. And once we do that, we're going to melt the white chocolate. So on top, we're going to put the rest of the chocolate chips, mini eggs, and drizzle some white chocolate. So, I'm gonna get the blondie out of the fridge because I'm gonna put it on. Oh, it's still so warm. Oh my God. It just won't cool down. I'm gonna put it on this plate because that's what I'm gonna keep it on and I'm gonna decorate it on. It's probably not gonna put it on a plate because it needs to cool underneath, but time is of the essence. And then we have our bowl of melted chocolate. We're gonna put that on. We're gonna use the rest of the white chocolate chips and all these amazing mini eggs. I'm just gonna crush these up quickly. Oh my god, I didn't realise how many were left. <laughs> After all this baking, I will have put nearly a kilogram of mini eggs into this. They look so good. Okay, this is going to go in the fridge now to set. So much chocolate on it. And then, the loaf cake has just come out. So, I'll show you that. Oh my god, the loaf is out. This looks so, so good. I'm gonna let this cool and then we're gonna decorate it with all of this. I just quite liked it. I don't know, I'm gonna go there. Like 55 quid's worth of Emma Willis next dress. <laughs> I've got it in the sale for 15 quid. Oh, I didn't beat the butter. Sorry, go on. Sorry. <laughs> go on. And then the tyrantic rage when I was like, I hate everything, put it on in the uh, shelter bag. Mm. This is the one that I sleep thinking about getting back out. You've got to get out of my car. Why did you. <gasps> <gasps> oh, oh, oh. She's stupid, is what the matter is. <laughs> Why did you got... don't label yourself? Why did you not leave some in that bowl? I don't know. Don't label yourself. Apparently, we put all these on this cling film. What's that doing there? Whose horse is that? <laughs> Whose horse is that? What's to get? Just listen. I don't understand how the cling film. Just listen to Jane. I don't. Well, now I'm not going off. Why? To get right to end. You don't have to go right to end. Oh. Okay. Orange. In. Oh. Egg yolk orange. It's kind of like, it's more pastel. Next. Um, how close do they have to go together? You touch it. They need to blend into one as they come out, don't they? I'll do white next, shall I? Do you know what I mean? It's not a video, it's text. Mm. Why is that one like mashed potato consistency? <coughs> this one's ours. Because this has had no food colouring in it. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, mashed potato. Some colours aren't very aesthetically pleasing. It's cream egg! <laughs> It's really, really good, Antonia. <laughs> I'm not disabled, Mum. Wait. 
What's that? to be three colours. What's that snail colour? Snail? It's what? cream egg colours. Is it brown yet? Yeah. Looks quite nice, changing colour. <laughs> yes, Antonio, well done. <laughs> oh no, you have got to encourage her. She's so, she spent the whole day baking. Yes, I know, I've been studying. <laughs> Filming it. <laughs> oh, no. What? what? No! no. <laughs> <Don't> ch <laughs> and you can't stop me. guys thank you so much for watching if you made it to the end of this video I'm very proud of you because this took me a hell of a long time to make and edit and everything it's been one of the heftiest videos I've edited for a while I'm not sure why because yeah it just took me ages and um, so I would really appreciate it if you could like this video and sub sub blah, 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 and subscribe to my channel Honestly, it would mean the world to me, and it literally takes a second, just click it, click, click, click. Um, yeah, it really means the world to me, so thank you very much. I'm just sat in my corner, my editing corner, um, finishing this vlog off. So, I thought I would film a quick outro. But thank you so much for watching, guys, and thank you for your continued support. If you do watch all my videos, thank you so much. I know there's only a few of you here, and we're still a very small channel but I appreciate every single one of you, so thank you so much. I have another vlog coming at the end of this week, maybe or the start of next week, so keep your eye out for that. And yeah, thanks guys. Bye.